My name is Catherine Boyer. I am a Métis artist. I work with beadwork, material, textile, wood, um, and I'm presently living and working in Winnipeg, Treaty 1 territory, and I'm originally from Regina, Saskatchewan, Treaty 4. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. Grab a spot and uh, yeah, we'll, um, I'll sort of keep you caught up, um, but I'm gonna get started on the rest of the group. You bring it all the way through, I'm just gonna walk around. So I grew up um, within a very sort of like urban, middle class, white context, but I just don't remember being taught about the Métis in school in any real way that obviously like rang true for me. You know, it was only upon later in life that that I started to try and like unravel what that meant in a visual manner. I started working at the First Nations University of Canada in um, 2013. I was just beginning to do the research to understand how the Métis fit in within a creative and cultural and social political spheres. And I just, you know, saw that it really excited me to see that identity represented visually. I had not seen a lot of that represented when I was growing up, so um, I felt that there was a need for it at the time and I wanted to also just sort of do my own research and find my own place within those many kind of worlds. So tonight is the opening for the exhibition. Um, Labor is the body, time is the bridge at neutral ground. I chose to focus on five women, a line of five women in my family, and uh, really bring attention and awareness to the impacts of their lives on their own Métis communities and also on the kind of wider um, social, cultural, political um, realms that they also occupied. So the, uh, the work touches on Métis history at large, and then also a lot of personal family narratives. You know, this, this type of work that I've uh, done here is, you know, on a, on a personal note, really trying to place myself um, and understand where I sit and where my family sits and, yeah, trying to understand how that history still impacts us today. I mean, Winnipeg's roadways drive along the pre-established river lots, so it's it there. It's within the land and within the urban infrastructure around us. And I think to keep that history fresh and present is something really important to me. But then, what I've also found is that every time I present work that you know has some type of event or history or I touch on maybe a moment in time, people come up to me and they have new information. So it's, it's, it's not just um, to output, I always get a lot back from people. I wanted to introduce Catherine Boyer, who I'm sure many of you know. Um, should I read your bio? <laughs> So everything that's in this space has taken time and touch and love and care um, and a lot of um, consideration to pull together. So um, yeah, it just means a lot that uh, you're all here looking at it. <laughs> to me, it's all about learning and understanding better and um, so, you know, I always sort of receive, you know, what people tell me. So that was really what kind of started me um, on this trajectory. It's who I am and it's um, how I navigate the world and, um, you know, it's, it's how I see things. <laughs> <laughs>